And as we've been saying, these temperatures are no place for pets. And the Warren County Dog Warden wants to know who dumped seven Shelties out in the extreme cold. Two of them died. Angela Ingram shows us how the five who survived are doing. Five Shelties have a temporary home out of the cold, but they will still have a long way to go. They were found abandoned last Wednesday at Caesar Creek State Park near Old Hickory Lookout. They were not um, groomed very well. They had large mats, uh, which we're currently starting to work on. They were very unsocialized. We have at least two that could possibly have some neurological deficits. The Shelties run in circles. That makes Joanne Hurley think they've been crated for most of their lives. And even these kennels are overwhelming for the small dogs. I know that the warden said that he found one laying in the snow with big ice balls attached to it and frozen fur. And when he approached it, um, it couldn't even run away properly. It, it could only run in circles. Two of the Shelties didn't make it. The Humane Association says because they were dumped in this area, they ran across State Route 73 and got hit by vehicles. The most important thing is now is that we get them to the vet, we get blood work going, we make sure there's no upper respiratory, no, no urinary um, problems, anything like that. Now the dogs will need a lot of care, and workers here at the Humane Association of Warren County will need help with the medical bills. We do a basic triage here, but when we get cases like that in, we don't know what kind of conditions they were kept in. They also want to know who would do something so heartless when so many people would love to offer forever homes to these Shelties. So we're looking for any information. Someone has to know that someone now does not have seven dogs. It did not have to be that he dumped them in the worst of weather, not knowing how to defend themselves or find themselves shelter, you know, leaving them vulnerable to predators, hit by car. You know, there were so many things that could have and did happen, and it just wasn't necessary. In Lebanon, Angela Ingram, Local 12 News. If you have information on who dumped the dogs or if you would like to donate to their medical expenses, we have a link on our page for the Humane Association. Go to local12.com.